Hey guys, I'm gonna get my back here for the video, guys. Today we have another GTA 5 video, and today, guys, we're taking a look at Animal Crossing in GTA 5. So this is gonna be kind of interesting, and I can't get over this fence because this fence is freaking crazy. So let's go ahead and spawn in a vehicle real fast. Do vehicle uh vehicle spawning and sure through this vehicle. We had to run right through this fence. Hypothetically speaking, say, yep, there we go. All right, guys. So, oh my gosh. Okay, so there's a fun. Oh my god, the sand, man. Look at the sand in my car right now. This is absolutely insane. Okay, uh, let's move my car over here to maybe more of an area that's not as sandy. I want to say. All right, let's take a look at this, guys. So I've never personally played Animal Crossing. Personally, myself, never played it. But I know a lot of people love this uh, freaking game. And it does make sense. It's very popular. Uh, but we have Nook's Cranny. So if I if I say something correctly, if I don't know what something is, don't kill me in the comment section. Again, I've not played this game. I'm just reviewing this map to see how it looks and everything like that. And, you know, like, see how amazing this actually looks. Because, again, not personally played the game, but I can still respect some very, very amazing map creator stuff and we are john wick you guys do not know this is actually a fortnite character john wick so we're playing as fortnite character we also have another fortnite character we can look at is uh, actually omega but for right now we're just going to stay with uh john wick so is i want to understand this is like what oh my gosh there's a whole entire thing you jump over right there good thing i had a car i didn't have a car that's gonna gotten bad is this like a race oh it's like a racetrack Oh, that's actually freaking dope. Is this actually, like, I don't know if this actually is part of the game. Anyway, though, it's kind of like a racetrack, which is actually freaking awesome. Now, let's do the race real fast, and then we're going to go ahead and look at the whole entire map and see what's going on. My car is absolutely destroyed, and I should also work, work on my drifting skills. Because, oh, lordy, nope, that did not go well. <laughs> All right, so let's not have me ever do that again. Anyway, though, let's go ahead and take a look. So, I don't know if uh, racing is a part of Animal Crossing. I don't think it is. Uh, but we'll still take a look at what this looks like. Okay, so it's actually a whole entire race. Wow. Okay, I, I didn't realize how big this actually was. I thought this was like a little a map area. But no, this whole entire area is a gigantic thing. And right here we have the race. Okay, so we have it. looks like a town hall up here we're about to get to. And this time I actually did not hit that correctly. That. All right, let's get out of the car here, and the car is going to go by itself. Let's go ahead and take a look at this. So again, um, I know this is what on Nintendo Switch. I know I don't know all the things that they have the, this game on. But let's take a look at this town hall. So this town hall, and go over the little thing. All right, and let's look. Oh, wow. All right, so we can't go inside. There's nothing inside, and a lot of these maps we look at. You know, it's kind of just like the outside, which is a really cool part of it. It's not really the inside. Obviously, if inside, there wouldn't be really any purpose for that. It's just like how it looks. But the Animal Crossing sign right there. We have what looks like little huts. I wish you, I wish I could do an Animal Crossing character to use them as this, but sadly, I could not find one. We have Aunt, welcome to Animal Crossing, okay? We have the Able Sisters. Okay, interesting. I think the I was gonna say I think the whole entire like yeah this whole entire place is actually a it's a full place it's just nothing inside. And let's see what's behind it. All right, so a lot of trees. It's a back part of this. Okay, that's kind of cool. Again, guys, I've said this in many videos. I just love how much detail people add into these GTA Five you know mods. And okay, we cannot read the language that's written there, so that's not going to be a thing. But we have gigantic tree right here in the middle, which would make sense. Um, and then we have okay, so I'm trying to figure this out. So that's like what looks like a courthouse. This looks like what would be town hall, probably most likely, just because it's like a gigantic clock and gigantic freaking speakers and stuff. That looks like that. Oh, wait, there was a whole entire left side here what's actually over here see what we can actually see through this area right here 
All right, let's go all the way. Ooh, okay, the steps are kind of janky, not going to lie. Um, Kind of like, uh, you know, the Minecraft stuff we look at, guys. You have to actually go ahead and do that. Look how small we are compared to this. Like, oh my god. <laughs> it's so funny because a lot of these mods, they're gigantic. And when you think about it, like, okay, so if you want to say the GTA 5 character is a real life person, right? Height wise, six foot tall, let's say, around that height. Can you imagine how tall this Animal Crossing, like, characters are? Because this is absolutely insane. The height difference in all this. Okay, so I think we're getting out of the car. I'm getting out of the area here. So let's go ahead and go back. And let me go ahead and go to a uh, vehicle. Let's spawn in a car. There we go. I don't know why I keep spawning in this car. You know what? Fine. We'll just do this car, okay? All right, so let's go ahead and see. I think, okay, so we have some more houses over here. Obviously, we get there as we do the race. Uh, we have a bridge over here, which actually, let's go ahead and take a look at that. Um, let me get out of my car again. And let's actually do a free roam type of thing. We can take a look at the bridge. So it looks like the bridge is not completed. We have a tunnel that actually goes to absolutely nothing, but still very cool. It's actually a tunnel. Uh, so, okay. So again, like the attention to detail on the outsides, because this is theoretically speaking, right? This is a race. That's what this map is actually supposed to be. It's an Animal Crossing race. But the attention to detail on the outsides is just absolutely gorgeous. And if we go ahead and look over here again, so again, we had a town, we had a uh, downtown here, which we have the rental or retail. Awesome, that's kind of funny. Um, we have another house. It looks like just be random people's houses, I'm guessing. Obviously, the game can go up and talk to them, but you can't do that here. Uh, okay, so I guess, is this all house in the game? I guess this would be the house that the character would actually go off of. Let me down below how accurate this is to the actual Animal Crossing game. I'd love to hear it down below, guys. Animal Crossing right there, we have like, it kind of looks like the colors of Chick-fil-A in a way. <laughs> I don't know why. I'm just, okay, I haven't eaten really at all bad in so long, guys. If you have not seen my update video, I lost 20 pounds. So everything that is bad to eat, I automatically think of. So all these houses, like I said right here, these are all freaking empty inside. There's nothing inside. But the outsides, are what, of course, is what we're looking at. And it's actually freaking dope. Guys, tell me down below your thoughts and opinions of this map. Do you love it? Do you hate it? I'd love to hear it. Now, if you don't play Animal Crossing, obviously you might not, you know, know anything about Animal Crossing. I don't know as much about Animal Crossing. So definitely tell me down below if you do play Animal Crossing. Because I know some people who watch my channel, they probably do. All right. So what are we doing here? Oh yeah, so let's go look at Omega. So this is what Omega looks like. I grinded so freaking much to get this Omega and yeah, in uh, actual Fortnite, but still. All right, let's go ahead and take, what car do we want to take? Uh, let's go a funny vehicle. Actually, let's do a funny vehicle for, to end off this video, guys. Let's go to vehicle uh, options, spawning. And let's go to funny vehicles. Let's go ahead and do this race with, um, I think it's uh, the Pooh Mobile. Let's do the Pooh Mobile on this race, guys. Nobody else can do the Pooh Mobile. Oh my God. Okay, the turning in this Pooh Mobile is not the greatest. Okay. Oh no, I'm not going to make that jump. The Pooh Mobile is freaking too crazy. All right, let's see. Do the turnaround. Ooh, okay, here we go guys. Pumobile for the win. Oh, and oh my gosh. Okay, so you had to get over that. You had to hit over that in order for it to be okay. Oh my gosh. Don't hit the stamp. Don't hit the dirt blocks. Oh, Pumobile. The Pumobile did not stand a chance, guys. It did not stand a chance. Okay. Let's go ahead and see real fast. Oh my gosh. Okay, it's a little crazy. Okay, the handling of the Pooh Mobile is the issue. I think that's the real issue, guys. Is the Pooh Mobile handling is definitely not what I was expecting. I was expecting a little bit less of a handling issue with the Pooh Mobile, but apparently, okay, we have the final area right here, guys. The final lap. And let's see. Oh my. Um, okay. So the Pumobile has a door and that door just fell off. 
I'm going to go all the way over here and we're going to try to I'm invisible. It's okay though. I'm invisible. I'm still in the Poomobile guys. I'm still in the Poomobile and we're going to win the race Won the beat There we are Bam guys. Thanks so much for watching. See you guys the next one. Peace out